catch up and get ahead with the edge for the week of April 25th. Who is Harriet Tubman and why is she going on the $20 bill? University of Texas at San Antonio professor Catherine Clinton wrote a biography describing how Tubman smuggled scores of slaves to freedom on the Underground Railroad and was a scout, a spy, and a liberator for the Union Army during the Civil War. Basically, Tubman was as tough as nails. The former slave risked her life countless times and even performed an ad hoc dental surgery on herself while on the road for the Underground Railroad, Clinton told the Washington Post. At Nowcast SA, we compiled an anthology of articles and videos about Tubman, along with links on where you can buy Clinton's book or download a digital copy of her book from the San Antonio Public Library. As her signature initiative, San Antonio Poet Laureate Laurieann Guerrero challenged people in the community to write love poems to the city. The winning poems were transformed into artistic renditions on the walls of the Cultured Commons in the Plaza de Armas near City Hall. At Nowcast SA, we recorded the artist's poems and preserved the magical exhibit on video. We're releasing one video now and we'll publish a series of love poem videos over the next few weeks. So stay tuned and please share. How did a dropout prevention program propel Ray Saldana from San Antonio's South Side to Stanford University? Saldana was in the second grade when he became a mentee in the Intercultural Development Research Association Coca-Cola Valued Youth Program. He says the dropout prevention program helped him envision himself as a high school graduate and go on to the university before becoming the youngest person elected to the San Antonio City Council. Join Nowcast SA on Tuesday, May 3rd for the webcast of the historic impact of Henry B. Gonzalez on politics and public policy. The event commemorates what would have been the 100th birthday of the San Antonio Congressman, affectionately known as Henry B. Hosted by the UTSA Office for Community Services and the College of Public Policy, the panel discussion will focus on Gonzalez's nearly 40 years in Congress where he was an outspoken critic of the Federal Reserve Bank and a fierce defender of ordinary people. The event is free and open to the public, and you can watch live online or replay it later on Nowcast SA. Go to Nowcast SA for more on all of these stories. And as always, thanks for watching The Edge.